DIY Damn It Father's Day edition. I don't know about your dad, but my dad is so hard to shop for. I think that's because he hates shopping. So what better to get the guy who has everything something he's not going to expect. Something DIY deed. Today we will be making DIY aftershave for that very special guy in your life. Watch out Aqua Velva, we're coming for you. The use of aftershave dates back to Roman times. Oddly enough, so do my dad's jokes. What do you call an elephant that doesn't matter? Irrelevant. You hear that rumor about butter? Never mind, I shouldn't spread it. Can't run through a campsite. You can only ran because it's past tense. When I was little and I'd be frustrated, I'd go, Dad, I'm serious. And he'd go, Nice to meet you, serious. I'm Jocelyn's dad. This is one DIY that is super easy. You basically mix up the ingredients and put them in a container. So it is very hard, very hard, very hard to mess up. The easier the better. It's not that I take the easy route, it's just the easy route is so much easier. Supplies you will need for this craft are aloe vera gel, witch hazel, glycerin, essential oil, and some containers to put your aftershave in. First step is to take a quarter cup of your aloe vera gel, quarter cup of your, oh no, it's spilling everywhere, quarter cup of your witch hazel, a tablespoon of vegetable glycerin, and now you're gonna whisk this until it's combined. Ew. You're gonna whisk, you're gonna whisk this until it's combined. Uh, and don't spill it all over yourself. Just a tip. Okay, and your next step, once that's all whisked together, is you're gonna add your essential oil. And this is up to you what you want it to smell like. Or what you want your dad to smell like. I don't know what I want my dad to smell like. So you're gonna add about 15 drops of whatever scent you choose or combination of scents and mix that into your mixture. Mixing, mixing, mixing is so fun. Now if you want your aftershave to be a little less thick, you can add some water just a little bit at a time until you reach whatever consistency you'd like it to be. I have no idea how thick aftershave is supposed to be. So I'm just gonna wing it. Once it's all mixed up, it's time to put it into your container. And that's all! Now you have an aftershave for your dad and he can shave his face and feel refreshed after and you can make dad jokes and we can laugh and laugh. And The one last thing I'm gonna do is just write on this bottle so, you know, nobody thinks it's something that it's not. I'm gonna tell you what, it looks, um, it looks like something else. So it's probably best if we label the bottle. So now you can see it's all labeled and ready to give to your dad. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. And if you've got a good dad joke, please leave it in the comments. Oh, and if you have something you want me to make, please let me know. If you've made anything from the series, please show me with hashtag DIYDammit. And we shall see you next time. Happy Father's Day!